Hi everyone and welcome to the first part of this tutorial where we will build a water detection robot. This robot will alert you with a warning tone and ask for water when it's thirsty. Just refill the container and the robot will be happy again when it detects water. For this project we will need rack a bit with micro bit, servo motor and soil moisture sensor. Connect the servo motor to port labeled S1, orange to signal, red to power, and brown to ground. Connect the soil moisture sensor to I.O. port P2 and P12, black to ground, red to VCC, white to P12, and yellow to P2. To begin building the code, follow these steps. Open a browser and navigate to the make code editor. Create a new project. Add Recabit RPT Project Kit extension. First, we need to get the threshold value. Add the following blocks to show the reading of the soil moisture sensor when button A is pressed. Now download the code and try it out. Press button A to get the reading. Insert the sensor in an empty container and slowly add water until the minimum water level. The reading now is 535. And when the container is full, the reading is 458. We can observe that the reading is high when the probe is dry and the value decreases as more water is added. This is the threshold value. We want the robot to alert us when the water level falls below the minimum level. Now let's build the full project code. Under the on start block, add show smiley face icon block and set servo S1 position to 0 degree to lower the robot's arm to its side. Under the forever block, add the following blocks. Always check the water level. If the value is less than 550, which means water is above the minimum level, then show the yes icon. Else, if water falls below the minimum level, show the no icon. Play a warning tone. Set servo position to 180 degrees to rise the robot's arm for one second. Finally, set servo position back to zero degree to lower the arm. Now download the code to your micro bit.
That's all for today's tutorial on building a water detection robot. We hope you found it helpful and you are now ready to build your own robot that will alert you when it meets water. If you need assistance or have any questions, please feel free to reach out. We are here to help. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video. Keep learning and happy making.